I think I got it. I think we're up. I think we're live. Yeah, we're good. What's up, guys? It's me, Todd, the Flippin' Hustler. And uh, it's time to do some work. That's why I have a suit on. Whenever you see me have a suit on, that means it's time to get down to it. And uh, it's time to take a bunch of pictures and that kind of stuff. So when you, cop when you stop in, I'll say I appreciate it. Thanks, guys. Oh, what's going on with my volume? Let me move this over here. Get the there's nobody here. Okay, now there is someone here, so I better get this situated. All right. What's up, Craig? How you doing, sir? All right, now let me get this fired up over here so I can check the chat. And we're just going to knock out pictures. That's the point of today's show. Knock out pictures. So I'll be walking over here every once in a while, but mostly I'll be over here. Do my thing, but I'll be watching right here. We got Craig, what's up? Jennifer Hayes, how you doing? Justin, thank you for being here. Mary Brown, thanks for being here, Mary Brown. Caffeinated Christy, how are you? Jody, what is up, buddy? How you doing? Everybody, everybody, say hi. All right, so now we're good. Everything's working. I'm just going to use uh, my camera to take pictures. I'll use the camera, and I'll use my phone. And I'll just watch the chat on the laptop. Tuxed out Todd. <laughs> nah, every once in a while I'll throw a, a suit on. Or at least a three piece. <clears throat> so let me know if you can hear me clearly. If not, I can move the phone over. But this thing has pretty good microphones. So we should be good. <coughs> and we're just going to start taking pictures. I already got a whole bunch of stuff set over here. So, we're going to go like this. Now, I know you probably got it, you're thinking, geez, Todd, you're using a black background. Aren't you supposed to be using a white black background? Yeah, you are. <laughs> so, don't do what I do. But there's certain things like a white plate, it's a limited edition, blah, 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 but it's white. And if I were to put this on white, it would bleach out, right? So I put it on black, and it works out. Thrift Mine, what is up, dude? How you doing, man? Thank you for being here. Justin's here. Justin's here. Craig's here. Crazy Dreamers. So that's, uh, come on, brain. Work for me. Uh, wow. I don't know. My brain just went. South, man, it's thrift mine. Uh, it's Pam and Ryan. Whew. Wow. That was a struggle for some reason. Alright. So here we go. Knocking out pictures. I feel black backgrounds on white is bright as nice. Todd looks good from over here. Okay, good. Thank you. Everyone hit the thumbs up on your way in. Appreciate that. Alright, so let's get to it. Oops. Hope everyone's having a great Saturday. I see a lot of people have gone live. They've had some fun. I saw that Pam and Ryan were playing in the hot tub. Heck yeah. If I had a hot tub, I'd play it too, guys. So that's cool. And Hit Flippin' Mama and uh, Every Day I'm Hustling and all those guys. Man, they had like a five-hour show. So that's cool. I was just laying back in the cut, doing my thing, and then it was time, so. If anyone has any questions, feel free to say, hey, Todd, I have a question, man. I'm going to try this camera out and try to see how this looks. Laying on the couch, waiting for the football game to start. All right, cool. I buy, sell, sparkle. Hey, Todd and everyone. Hi. I buy, sell, sparkle. That would be Dab's Kitty Sparkles. Am I right or am I right? Nice. Who's playing? Hey, Tiffany. How you doing? Thank you for being here. I missed you earlier. Yeah, Dab Kitty is here. All right. 15 people here. One thumbs up. Let me refresh this. Maybe it's, I don't know, maybe it's uh, frozen or something. Hey, thanks, Ryan. It says I'm looking snazzy. I appreciate it. I'm in uh, business mode, man. 
it is business mode time for me. So that's why I do it. Puts me in the right state of mind, right? Sometimes I have to change the exterior to get the interior to do what I need it to do, right? <clears throat> I've had people say, Todd, why don't you use a camera to list? So much better because, I don't know, it is, they say. So I'm going to try it. This doesn't seem to zoom very well, though. Or like autofocus. What the heck? Alright, we're not going to mess with this. See, that's why I don't mess with it. It takes good pictures and, and video, but I don't know what, what the deal is. Who are you going to be rooting for Craig? You use your phone, okay. Yep. I've always used my phone, and it, uh, well, has, it's always worked, so. Just go ahead and knock this out, boom, boom. And I'm not going to be in a big hurry or nothing like that because I'm just going to work, man. This could go two hours. It could go five hours. It could go nine hours. I don't know how it's going to go. All I know is I need to take pictures because I've listed everything I have. I've edited everything I have. I've done everything I can do now to here. Now it is time to take pictures. And there was a time back in the day, you know, a year ago seems like a lifetime ago at this point, but a year ago, man, I would do two, three, four hour live shows, just working, and I'd get so much accomplished, and that's how I met so many of you guys, because I would just be here, right? And things changed, and, you know, life happens, and whatever, man. But now, here we are. So I appreciate you and every one of you for being here, taking time out of your day to stop in, and I know people are going to come, people are going to go, and that's good. That was just water, guys. Too late in the day. It is 444. Is John Nevermore Antiques here? Because uh, it is 444. Now, do you guys... I'm just going to start asking you guys questions, okay? How about that? Who uses... A tailor's measuring tape? Who uses a ruler or who uses a measuring tape, measuring tape? I've tried all three and I use all three, but for a while, primarily I've been using the regular old measuring tape because it just seems to pop harder in the picture, right? I can just see it so much more, so clear. I can hook the edge of it. I mean, I don't know. That's just me. So, Dab Kitty says she uses a real measuring tape. Measuring tape for Tiffany. Jody uses a measuring tape. Craig uses a measuring tape. Uh, I want the little Polaroid photo one. <laughs> Polly, hey, what's up? Lisa, Lisa, what's up, Lisa? Have you seen the, uh, that Pauly Shore has a, a web, or a YouTube channel? Yeah, I saw that. And, yeah, and he, he's released a couple of his different documentaries and stuff. Yeah, it's pretty cool. He's out there still doing his thing, you know, but I was like, wow. All right, next up is this, what would you call this? Uh, it's Coca-Cola sign. It's made out of wood. It's got a hanger on the back. Don't know that it's old, uh, but it was part of that collection I got. It's about a, what is that? About a oh, 24, maybe a 20 inch by 12 inches or something like that. But put a picture of that and knock it out. That'll be easy to ship. Nice and flat. Check that chat. Vintage sign. I've not seen that, but I will find it. Yeah, definitely go find it, Lisa. Tiffany saying hi. Everybody saying hi. All right. 
Now, I've been keeping a, uh, a glass cleaning cloth. I use this when I detail cars, but it's for glass, right? And I keep it around, and I'm constantly wiping down the lens of my, oh, my, my phone or whatever I'm using because, you know, you get fingerprints and whatnot. So I just get in the habit of doing that. One bad thing about a black background is, boy, does it show everything, you know? I've also noticed that, too, if, if I take pictures when I have glasses on, I can see so much better, and the pictures usually come out better. Let's see here. That's almost too much. So I could put a little more angle on this table, but... So I don't have to do it like that. Just not used to this phone. It's been uh, hiding out for a while. Here's a live chat. So, for a long time now, I've been trying to get, uh, I take my pictures with measure tape in there, even if it's a hard good, you know, generally that's reserved for, I guess maybe not reserved for, but generally it's when you do clothing, you got to do your size from under to arm, whatever. And even on stuff like this, because people are going to say, hey, what size is it? It happens. Precious, what is up? How you doing? Thank you very much. That table rocks. You like that, huh? I've got another one, too. Upstairs outside in the garage. And I was thinking of putting it right over there. But I don't know. We'll see. Uh, where am I going to put this? Right. I'm trying to keep all the Coca-Cola stuff with the Coca-Cola stuff. All right. Um... I know what I'll take a picture of. I need to do this big clock, but I'm going to do something fun instead. Or that is, I think is more fun. It's that uh, Jan Sport kitty cat backpack. Isn't that cute? Look at that. It's got cassette tapes, whatnot. I saw that. I was like, oh, man, that'll be in good shape. All the zippers work. I tested them out. There's no extra goodies in there. Let me see, let's double check. But I mean, it's still got this tag thingy on there, so. No, that's brand new, it looks like to me, so. Right on. Darlene Buckland, how you doing, Darlene? Thank you for being here. Darlene, Darlene, Darlene. Lisa, Lisa says, so cute, I like it. Or maybe not like that, but so we'll just lay that right there. That'd be cute. That'd be a nice one. What's up, Mary Brown? Mary, Mary. I ran into Dab Kitty in some other chat yesterday. I haven't seen her in a long time. I was like, hey, what's your name, man? Change your name. What's going on? She's like, yeah, I changed it. What I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go into my settings real quick. I'm going to, let me go into my settings real quick and let's see what we got going on here. All right, can we do that real quick? Oops, not Google settings. Other settings. Display brightness. There you go. Brightness is way down, man. I'm like, geez, it sure looks dark. Something's wrong with my eyes. Let me clean off my eyes. No. Nope. She was off. Okay, there we go. Giddy up. 
thought I was tripping. I thought I was tripping. Let's check that chat. Backpack sell very well. My kids go through at least two a year. Wow. LOL, I've done that, Todd. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Jesus, my goodness gracious. Just like freaking boom, bam, right in my face. Right. That's what I'm talking about. Yes. Yes, that's great. I love it. <laughs> you guys have any song requests? It's been a long time since I sang, but you know, that's usually what happens when things get quiet when I'm just doing my thing. I just sing my way through it for a few hours so I can't sing anymore. Some of you don't know that. Some of you do. But if you don't know, now you know. Really bad when you're outside in the sun with screen down. Yeah, huh? I know. I know. I should put something inside this to make it more fluffy, huh? Let's make it fluffy. It looks like I've got some paper over here. Put that in there and that'll make it fluffy. What else can I put in there? Let's go over here. Another big bag. We'll put this in there. That'll make it fluffy. There we go. Well, hey, Kermit, should I jam you in there? Oh, jam you in there. I got rocks in there. Okay, I guess I'm not jamming Kermit in there. What do you think? <laughs> I know I'm walking over here. I need to walk over here. All right. So now we've got a nice fluffy plump backpack. I'll just go to right like that, set that like that, bust out the, uh, what you call it? L lint roller row. Yay, it's Tom! What is up, Tanya? How you doing? Everyone's Halloween plans. Well, I'm thinking I'm going to be a vampire. Caroline's going to be a vampire. Uh, so I'll probably be a vampire since I've, yeah, I've got everything I need. Alright. Looks good. Click clack. can't see it but looks good guys trust me these colors are like bam right in your face that's why I should have took the first picture out Don't work. Uh, that. Just get the cup over to me. This has two separate spots, so uh, what I'm going to put that there's two separate spots. Where did y'all go? We're getting back from. I'm coming to work, man. I'm coming downstairs. I helped Caroline do her pumpkin. I cut the top out and we took the brains out and all that stuff. That was fun. And uh, I came downstairs. I mean, anyway. I do this, Lisa. Oh man. Wait a sec. What the heck? Okay. So I just caught this. I was looking on the inside to take pictures. I don't know what that is. See that? It looks like throw up, man. But it's not throw up. It's almost like wax. Rubber? I don't know what it is, but whatever it is. Yeah. So now, what? Guys, 
I think it's glue? Maybe there was a, a liner in it? No. What the heck? Okay, we'll just throw this on the back burner. Great seeing you live, man. Hey, what's up, Thrifty? How you doing? I know, huh, Lisa? So, dang it, dang it, dang it. All right, well, don't get jammed up. Just keep moving. Here we go. I'm just joking. We'll put this over here. I'll probably donate it, and uh, that'll be that. That will be that, folks. All right, let's go ahead and do this Coca-Cola sign. It's pretty sweet. It says, Mmm, delicious. Delicious Coca-Cola. Oh, I hear it clicking. I hear it ticking. Oh, she's working. There's also a, a platter tray thing that goes along with this. Um, I have it listed by itself. What I should do is list them together if I had any sense. But I'm not going to. Kelly, hip flipping mama, what is up? How you doing? Thank you for the invite. I appreciate the invitation this morning. 9.30, I look, or what time was it? I looked at my phone at 9.30. I'm not sure what time you sent me a message, but, uh, so yeah, thank you for the invite. Doing well, Chris, I'm doing well. Isn't it cool? I like it. Hip flipping mama saying hi to everybody. My daughter left a banana in her backpack last year. Ah, I bet it was gross. Easy cleanup though? Yeah, we'll have to see what uh, what it entails. If I can clean it up, I will, because that's got to be a, a quick seller. Okay, now let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Okay, guys, I know some of you are going, hey, man, that guy's wearing Vans with the suit. What's up with that? It's because I'm in the basement, man. That's why. I guess I could be wearing dress shoes, but it wouldn't be that comfortable staying on concrete all day like that, so I didn't. But let me ask you this. When you're taking pictures of something that has a reflective surface, such as a mirror, how do you take a picture of it? Do you put your face all up in it like that? What do you do? Do you stand back? Do you stand back far like that and then uh, crop it? Because that's what I'm going to do. Stand back far and crop. Do the best I can to not get myself in there. Better if I had something I could stand on. No, don't stand on that. Oh, my head. All right, try this. <coughs> oh, look at that. Beautiful. Oh, but then there's there's my hands, and then there's the whole taboo. Maybe I should do a picture like that, just for fun. Oh. I like this, and I'll smile. Or I'll just go like, yeah. There we go. That'd be funny. Red, red, no. Nope. Nope. <laughs> I did a big old cheesy smile like that. I probably won't use it. 18 people here, 11 thumbs up. Appreciate it. Hope everyone's having just a tremendous day. Tremendous. Outstanding. Remarkable. And refreshing. Um, this is tricky. Um, yeah. Check that chat. Hit from Mama. I want one. Peter Ray, what is up, buddy? How you doing? Thanks for being here. It's a drafting table. Uh, it was actually, I got it from a grocery store. The a grocery store up the street. And it was sitting out back. There was two of them. And then a whole bunch of this black shelving stuff. And so I had my little truck, threw them in the back, dismantled them, brought them down. Uh, basically, I just have some, what do you call it? Uh, butcher's block paper or butcher's paper here. A tablecloth, another tablecloth, 
There's about a four by four square piece of wood sitting on top of it. And like I said, I've got another one outside that's, but I'm figuring if I put another one over here and I'm trying to take a picture of something that big, well then who the heck's gonna be shipping something that big? Not me, right? So this slides out like this. And then when I'm doing my VCRs, like I said, my VCR, got the little, you know, screen and whatnot right there. Yeah, it's pretty slick, man. Pretty, pretty slick. I was blessed. It was there it was, and yeah, man, you know. But technically, I pulled it out of the trash. So, no shame in my game. But I did go inside and talk to the lady at the front desk, and then she brought the owner around. And I talked to him, and he's like, yeah, for sure. So I was like, all right, cool. I'm in on it. <clears throat> and it tilts all the way up. I mean, I can tilt it, like totally tilt it right up like this. But when I do that, then a lot of stuff just slides down, and it's a pain in the butt. So I have it just, just tilted enough, but not too much. You know what I'm saying? Of course you do. This little thing worked out pretty slick, so I'm going to try that again. That. That. And this. Tricky, 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 tricky. Like the lap laptop stand? Nice, thank you. It would save your back. It would save your back. Peter Ray, what's going on over there, buddy? Let's see here. It's 5.04 there, so it is 11.04 p.m. Mr. Peter Ray's neck of the woods. I appreciate you being here, man. I hope you had a great day. I'm sure you did. So I put this rag right here so that my tape measure doesn't go rolling down, what you call it. Check that chat. Two. See me live. What's up, flipping crazy? How you doing? Thanks for being here. Nice to see you here. Yeah, I got this uh, base a couple years ago, and man, what a pain in the butt to try and put pants on and take it off. So I was like, I think I used it once. Um, then I had the lady with the top over there, and I used her more, but I'm trying to steer away from clothes, and man, I'm sure glad that I did with all the crap that's going on right now with changing all your sizes. Personally, out of 900 and some listings I have, I've got 130 that eBay is saying, don't meet the requirements, need to be changed, whatnot. I'm like, all right, I'll get on that. So, you know, I have to get on that. All right, what's next, folks? Why don't we do, we do, I'm kind of getting burned out on doing, like when, when you guys buy a whole bunch of one thing, like Coca-Cola stuff or whatever, man, Littlest Pet Shop stuff or Care Bears, when you get a whole bunch of like bras, when you buy 50 bras, are you like really get burned out by the end of it all? I know I do. That's just me. I should just be happy and be thankful that I have got the stuff, right? So, not tripping, I'm just saying. Boy, that sounds cool. Nice to be here representing the UK, right on. Keep on rocking in the free world. That has nothing to do with the UK, but... <laughs>
So back there, behind there, see how it's white? I've got a light down there shining up on it, giving it that backlight, which works out pretty good. Y'all was wondering. Make sure to zoom in on this thing right here because it says official licensed product. We got a picture of the inside. She got a little dent on it, but all right. Let's see. Wilkes Bar, Pennsylvania. Wilkes Bar, Pennsylvania, folks. Oh, wow, sounds cool, Mary says. You should say Mary Brown, Forever 21 is going out of business. Woohoo! Oh, I mean, that's terrible, but all right. That's good for all y'all. Now they're going to go buy it up. Go get it. Um, how am I going to do this? I think I'll go like this, and I'll just do the lid. That should be good enough. Sometimes, depending on the reflection, too much is too much. Uh, this is going to roll. Okay, I'll just rest it on the ledge. Get the top. Boom! She's about half inches tall, I'd say. Something like that. Probably eight and a half inches tall. Should I bring you in closer, guys? You think? You guys have seen those, right? Of course you have. This is the original Rally Roots hanger that I made a video about. That video has got the most hits or most views out of all of it. It's my little Rally Roots hanger. And then I made the big flipping hanger because this one is great for about up to extra large, but when you get into 2X, 3X, you need something bigger. So I made a bigger one, and all I did was cut it out of some sturdy cardboard, put a hanger on the back, bada bing, bada boom, big flipping hanger. So that's how that worked out. How's that, is that a little better, maybe? <clears throat> Blurry man. Oh, now that's not good because this phone is not that phone. Oh, man. Man, it's a good thing there was a screen protector on it because it was like crunch. Uh. <laughs> my chat frozen or am I seeing things? I don't know. See if it still works. I'm sure it will. Come on, baby. Get to focus. Oh, that was rough. It hit right on the corner and just. You know what, I'm going to throw some tape over that right there because it's bad news. Bad news bears. And then just keep on trucking, man. Dude, this this is my old beater phone, you know, like in the winter time you have a beater car. This is my beater phone. But that doesn't mean you need to beat on it, right? Jeez. 
All right, back in business. That's already taken. Already did that, already did that. Let's put it away. I should probably slide this out of the way. So I have to walk around it every time, huh? Where should I put this? What the heck? It's not even in the shot anyway, right? Uh, let's see here. Off to see the American Metalcore Band Kills. Oh, dude, you're going to see Kill Switch Engage? Nice. You're going to go rock out. That's great, dude. Good for you, man. Go have some fun. Jump down in that mosh pit and mosh for me, would you? That would be a good time. That's what they should have at the eBay meetup is a, a mosh pit, huh? Reseller launch pit. But then, yeah. Maybe that doesn't make sense. Maybe that doesn't make sense. I don't know. UK. Oh, okay. They're on their UK tour at the moment. See, I've gotten into a bad habit of leaning against this because it was up against the wall earlier before I had the light going behind it, and uh, that's not good. Because every time I do, she rolls. Oh, it's got locks on it. Yeah, just lock it. But even still, it'll still wiggly, get wiggly, I'm sure. Now this is a Coca-Cola tin, but inside of it it has a puzzle, and on that puzzle is a Norman Rockwell, whatever you call it. It's of a Norman Rockwell scene. So we'll pop this off, take a look at it, and it's still sealed, so that's excellent. It's kind of what you want. And this came out in... 1998. Well, I guess you're right there in my face, man. Turn around, you're all up in my grill. What are you doing? All right, uh, 1998. It's right there. <laughs> Think about puzzles is they leave a lot of cardboard dust and stuff. So you have to clean up your area after you're done. I don't know how many pieces this is. Doesn't say. So it's whatever. Alright, what's next? What's next? I want to do something. It's a Coca-Cola Tom look at that. Tommy Service Station. Coca-Cola Tommy Service Station. I know several people named Tommy. Uh, we gotta clean up our mess though first. Bummer. That's all part of it. And these are the little tiny minor things that jam people up. Slow you down. Just gotta keep on. Go. Like that. Give a little flip around like that. Psh, psh, psh. That should be good like that, right? Just lay it back out. Come on, babe. Cardboard goodies off, right? Gotta get the cardboard goodies off, guys. <clears throat> Seventeen people here. One thumb, one thumbs up. Oh, thirteen thumbs up. Sixteen people. Here. Huh? That's weird how that works out. But 
guess it does. Alright, now we've got this little Coca Cola Town Square, Tommy's Garage, Coke Collection. Well, we're going to knock the dust. Got to knock the dust off that box. Let's say hi to some people. Let's say hi to Flippy Crazy. Let's say hi to Peter Ray. Let's say hi to Tanya. <laughs> oh, hey, man. I'd like to say thank you. Thank you to all the people that have uh, been sending me messages over the last three weeks. We get a lot of messages. People are like, Ty, what are you doing? Where you at? Just checking on you. Haven't heard from you. Just want to say hi. I'm like, hi. I'm good. You're doing my thing. How you doing? They're like, I'm good. I'm doing my thing too. I'm like, good. I'll be seeing you very soon. So, it makes the guy feel special. I appreciate it. Good. Pull this bad boy out. Oh, that's nice. Look at that. It's just Tommy's little gas station there. Coca-Cola 1998. Right there. And since it has a bulb, I reckon I should probably fire it up so we can check it out, see what's going on with it. Hopefully that bulb works. So that's another thing to bring up. If you're a reseller and you're selling electronics, Want to make sure you've got something around you can plug into, man. You don't want to be having to dig around and go, oh, golly gee, now what am I going to do? Not that you'd say golly gee, but you never know. Golly gee, you know. All right, so what am I going to unplug here? Plug the laptop for a second. Put this in. Turn this off. Turn this off, turn this off, okay, it looks like there's supposed to be these gas pumps that go right here, and they're broken off, so that's kind of lame, I'll just set them like that, someone else can glue them on, I'll put it in the description, okay, so I got it plugged in, let's see if it turns on, oh man, no sir, really? Well, that sucks and blows. All right. So if the bulb doesn't come on, could be two things. Could be the bulb. Could be the fuse. Let's take a look. Little tiny things. Can't hear them. So just to be sure, we'll go ahead and pop this out and look at the fuse. I can slide her open here. Use a uh. What? Use only 120 volt, 5 amp uh, fuse. Cool. <laughs> Go grab a screwdriver. Got a little arrow and everything. Oh, there you go. Got to be smarter than the fuse, Todd. All right, so inside these is a little fuse. Pop that out and take a look at it. Like I'm going to be able to see it. Let me grab some, some spectacles. Let's see. And if nothing else, I think I've got some other things around here that have. That's good. So then that tells me it's the bulb. So I can either find the bulb. Where's the bulb? Let's go find the bulb. We can do this. Nothing but a thing, right? My brain's telling me, Todd, you got a bulb stashed over here. 
so we're gonna go look and see if my brain's right. Ready? Rolling stuff around, looking over here on the ground. Gonna take a picture. See, my brain knows where everything's at. I'm just going with it. Hey, look at that. I knew it. Alright. Looks like we got one of these. So, I'll, I'll snag the bulb out of here. And keep on keeping on. Set you guys right there. Turn on some lights, because boy, did it get dark down here, huh? All right, there we go. Um, Set this on the table. Move this out the way. Turn you guys like this, boom. Like that, see? No big deal, we just stop what you're doing. Uh, dang it. Okay, that's all right. There's not one in there either. <laughs> uh, okay, let me stop and think. Okay. So that's what I'm going to do. We're just going to put it up there. I'll put it in the description. I'm not going to get jammed up on a, a light bulb. No, there's no bulb. You just have to... Uh... Oops. Uh, that's awesome. I like it. Man, this poor thing's got too much going against it at this point. It's got the broken thing. It's missing the light. Just gonna have to go in a back burner pile. What a bummer, man, because it was cool. It's the way she goes, folks. It's the way she goes. Set that over there and find something else. Let's find something else. What should we, what should we do here? Should we knock out some brassiers? in here so let's do this it's like an unboxing man sweet didn't plan on that there you go oops you guys are over there what are you guys doing over there i'm over here all right we'll set this up like this all right so what we got here uh so when I bought this stuff, the lady, she said, come check it out. I went to the basement, whole wall full of stuff, and then they just started packing it up for me. So by the time I came back, everything was already packaged, right? And I'm like, okay, cool. But I think the reason I have a list of this stuff is because I probably have to go wash it up. I've got to wash it all because it was sitting on someone's shelf for who knows how long. And everything is dusty. That is why. All right, now that I remember, let's change gears. Whatever. I mean, there's clothes and stuff over there. I'm just trying to avoid that. 
Here, let's look at this. Emperor of China game from 1972, I believe. This was given to me by a family member. His name is Ross. Cool dude. He's cleaning out the farmstead. Oh, yeah, look at that. This thing's mint. Jeez, look at that. Pretty amazing. So, we'll go ahead and picture this bad boy up, and that'll be good. Copyright 1972. I haven't looked it up, don't know much about it. My gut is telling me 1895. Well, I know. I haven't looked it up. But we'll knock this out. What's up? Hey, how you doing, Jarhead Entrepreneur? Thanks for being here, man. Are you Mary Brown? Go have dinner. We'll see you later. My gosh, you broke his ribs. Why'd you break your husband's ribs? Oh, no, he broke his ribs. Okay. A couple of weeks ago, I got a free vintage storage unit locker off Facebook Marketplace. I did a few videos on what was in it. Oh, nice. Very cool. Got a showcase free off the Facebook Marketplace. All right, clean it up. It's all connected. It Very good. I thought it was just the remote, the latest and known goes to That's good. Fast flips are good. I'm just reading the things here. Lisa from another Lisa. I definitely leased a little bit of Lula. Well, thank you. Thank you for understanding my absence. Pat D's. What is up, Pat D's? Pat D's, what's up? <laughs> Pat D's. I, you guys, I turn around and there you are. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh, better clean your, better clean your camera lens, Todd. Just be sure. No excuses, man. All right. Christy, Christy, and I were just talking about games. Uh, was it today, Christy? Day before yesterday? I don't even know. Might have been today. We, I was telling her, yeah, games are fun to do, but and they take up some space when it comes to laying everything out, right? Kind of sort of. Focus. Mm -hmm. Dang, I don't think this thing's ever been played, guys. It's like all crisp. You know? You know? Crisp. Crispy. Minty. Shoot, it don't even want to fall flat. Cool. I like it. And we'll check the chat. Adam, what is up? How you doing, buddy? Thanks for being here. Rambling Hick, what is up, Kelby? Thanks for being here, buddy. Captain and Christy. Yeah, we do that. Get you dogs. Everyone's saying hi to everybody, people rolling in, people rolling out. And that's what's going to happen, man. You know, when you do a long, a long stream, people come, people go, and that's cool. Like, that's, I do the same thing. I can only watch someone for so long. I'm like, man, I got things to do. And that's what everybody does, and that's cool. Oops, missed it. What'd you say? Lisa, yes, one day I'm coming down to hang with some other YouTubers and resellers. It's getting cold now. No much. Just having a lazy Saturday. Really, dude? Cool. Everybody needs a lazy Saturday now and again, right? There's 
not much to it. I mean, I gotta go turn something off real quick. It's the uh, dehumidifier going wow, 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 wow. Yeah, that's not good. That thing makes me crazy sometimes. Uh, let's see here. I thought he was back in the little business. No way, man. A decade of that is good. Styling and profiling. The only song that's playing in my head right now is Sharp Dress Man. <laughs> right on, dude. Every girl's crazy about a sharp dress man. That was a good jam. So if you don't know what it looks like, this is what it looks like. It's the game. Woohoo. I'm sure it's fun to somebody. You know? Oh, it's got a piece of game. Pretty basic though, as far as pieces go. Um, now, all of them are sealed, except the red. I don't know if that is intentional or not intentional. Because it is the Emperor of China game. So, you see where I'm going with that? All right, put that on the game shelf. Let me roll this clothing rack back out of my face like this. It's like a skating rink down here, man. I'm gonna bust out the skateboard and have some fun. Maybe later. That's that. All right. Next, uh, we did that, those, no, that stuff, this stuff, no, I don't want to mess with it, I don't want to mess with it, no, no, no. All right, well, I, this is what we do. Bust out my tote of braziers. All these are bras. And, you know, I sold a whole bunch of them, right? I sold a whole bunch. I bought a whole bunch, sold a whole bunch, and then they stopped selling. And I was like, why did they stop selling? Right? Well, the reason they stopped selling is because I had multiples of the same kind. And once it sold, I didn't know. And I didn't put them up there as multiples or whatever. Consequently, they're still sitting here in inventory, not listed, just money sitting on the vine. And so what I need to do is go through and figure out what is what. Yeah, and that can be done pretty easily. So we'll just slide this table over here. Grab, uh oh, just like this. I'll tilt this bad boy on its side. Bam! Bras. And then I'll just go through and see what I've got going on. And I'll just go like this. Give you guys a little tilt down action. Boom, boom, boom. And we're in business. How about that? Oh, but then this computer's over here. Okay, folks, just want to say hi. All right, Adam, we'll see you later, buddy. Thank you for being here. I do appreciate it. So what I'll do is I'll pull up my eBay. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and check out uh, for all these Calvin Klein pantyhose. Pantyhoses. It looks like we've got a couple different things I should probably go over there and ship. So I can do that. Calvin Klein. Yeah. Chat. 
Are you going to model them? No. No, I'm not. <laughs> but thanks for asking. Not into none of that, man. Alright, what do we got here? This is size B, 750, or 705F, so that one's listed. <coughs> Style, this is dope. Hey, what's up, man? How you doing? Thanks for being here. Appreciate it. I'm just sitting here working, doing my thing. So I like to do that while I'm live. All right, now these... See, when you're a guy, it, some of this stuff doesn't make sense. Because if you don't pay really close attention, you can make some lady really mad. Because, check it. 705F. 705F. Champagne. Champagne. 7 deniers. 7 deniers. 16 bucks. 16 bucks. But if you look close, size A, size B. Man, they should make that, like, large font. Right? Because that could be a problem. All right, but anyways, uh, now I need to go back and see which 705s are in there. Okay, so there's size B. Boom. Check out that size A. Wait, what's this one? Okay, this could be... See, there's so many different terms to learn about, like sheer buff or... Yeah, buff. <laughs> K19F size A. Okay, listed. Okay, these are different. So if you guys have any questions, feel free to ask. I've been doing this for three years now. Um, I buy things at garage sales, thrift stores, big box stores, Dollar General, mom and pop stores, wherever I can get a good deal and flip it. I put it on eBay, but now I'm starting to say, okay, I think I need to start putting it on more platforms. Um, now these are not listed. Okay, so there's money sitting right there. These, size A, are listed. Wait, double check. In a big old hurry. 705F, size A. Champagne. Okay, yep. Good there. Check that chat. Galaxy was born. I wish I had a big basement like that tile. I'm stuck with everything, including my office and inventory in a small 10 by 10 bedroom. Well, you know what? That's. You do the best you can with what you have. When I first started out, man, I started out in that bedroom, that room right there, right? So I had everything jammed into one room. My desk and just everything started right right there. And from there, it just kind of moved out here and then grew and grew and grew and grew. So just because you're in a 10 by 10 now, that's okay. A lot of times more space just gives you more messes, you know, more, more opportunity to make more messes. <laughs> that's what it is. This one is K19F. I mean, you know, might as well be a whole different language to me. Okay, what is this? K19F, size A. Those are buff, and these are black. See? See the difference? Craziness, craziness. 17 and 17, I like it. This is dope, says do yourself packaging ideas. All right, so let me ask you guys some questions now that I've got. I've got 18 people here. How'd you find me? Was it in your featured? Did you do a Google search for eBay stuff? How, how was it that you, you came upon me? I always like to ask these questions because uh, I think it's important to know. Okay, so those aren't it, those aren't it, those aren't it, those aren't it. Okay, so these three packs need to be pictured. Is there any way I can... Lot them together. See, I don't know. Because, ladies in the chat, we got size A, size A, 
and then we got a size B. Okay, so that tells me I can't use that. Now, this is X23I, this is K191F. Oh, okay. Innovative seam free shear, shear to waste. Whatever that is. And this is shear stretch with control top. I remember hearing that. It's probably heavier duty. Is there such things as heavy duty drawers? I don't know. Either way, these need to be pictures, so let's just do that. <coughs> Excuse me, we'll set these off to the side because I still have these brassieres to go through. So let's knock these out real quick. Uh, I should be able to scan the back, possibly, possibly not. I don't know if this old phone can do it. Come on, Nella Bell, can you do it? Can you do it? Looks like she can. Boom. All right, so 1804, 1545, 21 bucks, 21 bucks. Man, I must be way underpriced on mine. Let's check the solds. Okay, no solds. Look for completed. No completed. That's strange. Very strange. Let's see if these are apples to apples. K19F, yes. Those are sheer. Oh, those are sheer. Snag this one like that. I found you when Thrifty Dad was doing live videos like this. Nice. David's good people, man. David's brother. David's good people. Well, right on. I appreciate you being here, Galaxy. Tanya, once upon a time. <laughs> once upon a time. Uh, you were in live chats I was in. Then, you were on with Justin, RVA Flips, doing a live stream. And you've been hooked since. Really? Awesome. Tanya. Yeah, there are people that have been around since the beginning. Miss Keyline Kisses will probably pop in if I'm on long enough. Alright. Click clack. That boom. Oh, that's why I remember now. When you do it on this old phone, it goes one by one by one. You can't like just knock out a bunch, bunch, and then upload right away. Sheer to waist means no panty. The control top is the panty. Okay. Gotcha. Oh, I gotcha. I gotcha. 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 But thank you. I'm sure if I read the back here, it would explain it to me here. That one's that one. Stick this right over the chair. Next. Got it. Lisa, Lisa says, same here. Saw you in other chats I was in. Between the reselling and the music, I made sure to pop back in. Everyone needs a pop in their lives. <laughs> Thank you. Lisa, Lisa, appreciate it. Don't. Almost messed up. Go ahead and save. Save it as a draft. A 
couple pieces of pizza before I started this, but I should have eaten more. I wasn't thinking. Okay, finish your tune. Twenty bucks. Jeez. Last one, huh? Two watchers. I'll go ahead and use that one. That's a good one. Tables rolling, man. So, last night I watched a interview of this guy, and I read his book uh, probably I don't know, seven years ago or something. It's this guy who used to be involved with some craziness in his life, and now he's got a YouTube channel. So, I, But I watched his whole interview last night uh, on this other channel. PMD, I believe it is, named Patrick. So I watched the interview, and it's Sammy the Bull Gravano. Yep. And, uh, wow, what a great interview. You know, he's done some crazy things, obviously, we all know that. But to see what he did, where he came from, what he had to do to pay his dues, and then to come back to where he's at now and doing what he's doing, I'm like, wow, that's freaking amazing, right? Uh, so I reached out, I'm like, hey, Sammy. Or Mr. Gravano, you know, welcome to YouTube, because he started a channel, so welcome to YouTube. Looking forward to seeing the rest of your content. And uh, I should have said, stop in, say hi in my chat sometime, that'd be cool. Be nice to have uh, Mr. Gravano in the chat. You never know, he may be watching right now. So everybody, be on your best, best manners and have respect. <laughs> Great live, Ty. Got to go see you soon. We'll see you soon, Mr. Peter Ray. Take care, buddy. Be good. I'm not sure how long this is going to go. I mean, if we need intermissions, we can have an intermission. I mean, there was a time when I would do these long shows and I would have an intermission. And when the intermission time comes, I just put the camera over there on the lava lamp. I can't see it. Put on the lava lamp. And you guys watch that while we have an intermission. We'll see what happens. We'll see how everyone holds up. That's how I hold up. These are all just minor things that need to be done, you know. They're not like super major, blah, 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 big ticket items, but it's money sitting there, right? So, they allow that. 13 people here. Oh, no, 15 people here. See, computer. Oh, no, that says 15. Either way. Scan these bad boys. West First Bucks. Mm. What is up, dude? How you doing? Fifteen percent remaining. May run out of battery soon. Wow, what the heck? Man. This thing takes up the battery. Cause it was almost charged. Uh we're doing good. Is it a draft table? No. Well, people are saying it's a draft table. I don't think it's a draft table. Uh, I got it from a grocery store, and there's two of them. There used to be produce and tomatoes and stuff and whatever all up on it, I'm sure, at some point. Um, but it, it definitely works as a... Uh, could be a draft table. Okay. 
Okay, so there are no scan deals for this, so I'll just go ahead and take pictures of it. And that'll be it for the drawers, or the whatever it is. Still listing over here, but I'm getting hungry. Yeah, you know what sounds good is like something like a French dip. Doesn't that sound good? A French dip with some orange juice, maybe some baked beans on the side. Oh, that sounds good. Not gonna happen. Okay, that's that. That's that. That's that. I'm going to set these over here. Way out of way. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's see here. Type in. Type in, type in, type in. Well, I think what I'll do, guys, is I'm going to let everything go the way it's supposed to go, right? This thing, when the phone dies, that's it. Show's over. I'll continue on doing my thing, but I'm just going to let things progress the way they're supposed to go. I think that's the best thing to do. So, uh, that said, hey, what's up, Paul Turner? How you doing? I'll go ahead and bust out the brassiers and see what we got going on. Like this. Oops. Slide you back like that. Open up eBay on the laptop so I can just search it much faster. Oh man, that's ugly. Ugly numbers. That's to be fixed. Item title contains. Is a store your Vanity Fair? It says I've got eight Vanity Fair brassiers up, so, and I've got way more than eight in here. So, let's find out what the heck's going on, man. step on the table but this is ridiculous so I'm gonna say I had up there seven or something look at all these yeah I think good it's all right we'll fix it gotta run making coffee continue store and post jewel here great to see you live again catch you on the flip side but everyone share the love hey thank you very much for being here, Lisa Lisa I call every Lisa I know Lisa Lisa some people more than others especially Lisa S I'm gonna start putting the uh, last name initials in there. With all the Lisa, up, Lisa? Now, how do you say it? I don't know. There was a song. Matter of fact, let me find that, just for fun. Because it's our time. We can do it. It's our time. 17 is 17. That'll work. Uh... Okay. 
I'm sure you're familiar with the song, am I right? Let's see. You're the last three fresh nugs. This is gonna, I'm gonna ask you one question to see who can be in the video, okay? What do you want from life? Well, I want to feed the children, class, eat cocktails, Copyrighted, man. This is gonna be copyrighted, strict, copywritten, stricken all over the place. But that's all right. Whatever. We're having fun. Okay, so 42 Ds. There's a 40 D. There's a 40 D. There's a 42 double D. There's a 34 D. 36 D. I don't see a 42 D. Well, that's a problem, right? Sound like a song from the Goof Troop. Yeah, it was kind of a goof song. 40C, 38D, 40D, 34C, 40D, 42DD. All right, so this one, not listed. This one, 40C. It's like bingo over here. Okay, here's a 40C, 10, boom, boom, boom. There it is. This one's listed. That's important. Uh, I should probably open up the other chat. 44 double D G's. Animora. Oh, <laughs> Animora. Animora. Let's open up that chat. Okay, so this one is listed, so I'll put this back in here. Those are going to help check. Is this one. So 40 D. Like a noodle or something. Lisa, Lisa. Major. We're screwing up. I'm talking to you business owners out there. We're missing the bottleneck that's her harming us. We're missing the bottleneck that's her harming us. What a rookie. I'm over here just forgetting that I'm even live. Alright, uh, what did I say we got here? 40D. 40D black lace, vanity, flare, fatter, flattering lift. Full figure, boom, there it is. So, that's good. I'm going to have to go and adjust some prices. It looks like I've got that one up there for $24.99. Free shipping. Buy it now. This has an MSRP on it of 42 bucks. Might have to drop her down to 21 or something. Okay, so that one's up there. Get somewhere now, boys. 38 triple D. 38 triple D. 34, 36, I don't have a 38 triple D. Okay, so there's another one. I know I'm looking over there. I gotta look over here. Hi, Todd and everyone. Hey, what's up? Jameson's Closet, how you doing? What is this one? Another 38 triple D. So I might sell those together. That would probably be a smart thing to do, huh? How you doing, Jameson's Closet? Anamora, West First Books, Paul Turner, Christy Christy, Anamora, Lisa Lisa. Oh, y'all. Okay, this is... It's pink. I think it's pink. Kind of pink. 
38. Okay, this is a 42. D. Pink. Nope. Isn't that crazy? <coughs> I mean, and so what this tells me is these right here are just one of all the stuff that's down here. Who knows what is in here that is not listed? What's over here that's not listed? Where to go? Well, some things I had doubles of, but some things I don't know. Let's go back, check that chat. Marie. How you doing, Marie? I almost said Maria. I just met a girl named Maria. But I didn't. All right, this is a 42D in white lace vanity fair. Not listed. Redonkulous. I suppose maybe it's good because, you know, this is one of those things that everyone always needs. Uh, not everyone, but the ladies always need this. It's a need versus a want, so it doesn't matter if they've been sitting because it's not like they go bad, right? I think. Shouldn't. Okay, so this is not in there either. That's just craziness. That's like what? Let's, let's say they're 15 bucks on the low end. Okay, let's say 15. So there's 60, there's 90 bucks right there at 30 bucks or at 15 bucks a pop. That ain't cool. All right, let's go check that chat, see what's what. Good, thank you. Nice to see you. Nice to see you too. Thank you for the wave, or the clap, or the clap and the wave. Let's see, 42D. I don't see it. No, I don't. This one might be. I don't know. So put one over there. Flattering lift. There's a lot of terms, man. A lot of terms. Flattering lift boosts your natural curves. See an SRP of 42 bucks, so. I thought 20 something was fair. Gentle lifts. Support without the wire. See? Without the wire. How they do that? Smooth look under clothes. Okay. Well, anyway, not that it matters. Okay, so this is a 40D. Forty D. So what I got to do these things? Okay, so in this instance, would I, should I sell them together? Nah, because they're the same kind. But I could put the same size together, right? Two two different colors, or two different styles, same size. How about that? Tommy Bernhard, what's up, man? Hey, look, it's Tommy. Yeah, it's me, the flipping Hustler. How you doing? How you doing? All right, so that's that, that's that. Let's check this. That would be a 40D in blue lace, but look, this has a wire. Yup. 40D with the wire. Got that one up there for 1350. Got it roll. All right, we'll see you later. Tell your dad I said. How it going, baby? His dad, if you guys didn't know, is an Elvis impersonator. That's why I say it, man. <clears throat> 40D. Was this one I just put in here at 40D or my? Yeah, it is. Okay, so look. The same. Mm. So what I could do is I could put this one. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes. I could put that one and one of these. So I got a 40D with the padded, no wire, different look, and then the wired navy blue lace. Is that smart? What I do? I mean, or are girls like, I only, you, I only want wires. I only want wireless. They like the Wi-Fi. They like the Wi-Fi brassiers or the non-Wi-Fi. I don't know. You tell me. Let me know. It's 
Vanity Fair. We are picky. Yeah, I know. Very, very picky and specific, and uh, and that's why you know I just want to make sure I get it right. Cause I don't want to be the cause of anyone's pain. Like, man, I shouldn't have bought that bra from that guy off eBay. Cause I'm all uncomfortable now, and I don't even like it. He sent me a wire, and I, right? Okay, so this is a 36. Okay, so here's another one. Another one. Let's go check the chat on the laptop instead. Agreed. Same brand, same size. I would lot together. I buy one brand, one style. One style. You would not put the same size with a different style together. Okay. Well, you guys know better than I do. Hi, Bianca. How you doing, Bianca? My friend over there on the other side of the world. Ladies are all agreeing. Okay, good. Well, so now I know. Don't do that. Don't do that, Todd. See? If I didn't ask, well, how do I know? How do I know? All right. So this is Vanity Fair. Right here, D. That's a 40. So this is not listed either. I mean, that's good, I guess. I don't know. And here's another pink 42D, which is just like I did the same. The lace looks a little bit different on it. I don't know. Let's see. This has like a scallop look going on there. Right. Across the top. I don't know if this is scallop. See? I mean, it would be so easy to mess up, man. Because, like, this one, it's got no scalloping across the top. And I say scallop, I don't even know if that's the correct term. What the heck do I know? But completely different. Look, it. it's got, like, little things and this. So I could very easily, had I not taken this out, looked at the thing, said, oh, it's 42D. Looked at the color, said, oh, cool. But nah, too different. It's like, it's like juggling grenades over here, man. I could get myself in some deep trouble. I'm just joking. I'm joking, I'm joking. Okay, so this is, we didn't have this one, though, right? No. Okay, so there you go, Wills. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. A tenner, for sure. And then I've got these over here, which are doubles of other kind. So we're good. All right. Well, now that we know, it's time to just start knocking them out. I'm going to... These bras out of here. And put, I'm gonna have two different bins. I'm gonna have a pre-owned, because I do have some pre-owned bras. I'll have the pre-owned in the Todd Rendon bin, like that, and then I'll have the brand new tags and this one over here. I think that works. And since we're getting down to the wire, guys, I know the phone's probably going to die here in a little bit. I know the phone's probably going to die here in a little bit, and I didn't want to leave you without some of this. So that was all for you guys. Confetti. Boom. Got to have that, right? I think we're going to start with that weird one first. 38 triple D. Alright, 
So now in something like this, I've got a mannequin. I could use it, but she's not a triple D. I think she's like a 30. Mm. Oh, let me go see. Oh, uh, you're probably about a uh, 34C. I'm all, I don't know. I think it's about a 34C. Bianca says, nice color. Agreed. Okay. So yeah, this would not work on that. It would just sag and hang and look really silly. So we're just going to do flat lace. Um, and I think I'm going to use the black background again because a lot of these, like on this pink, it will just wash out so bad. That was part of the problem initially was anything that I had up there that was pink, it was washing. It was washing. Washed out. Well, I would like